Yes, finally, 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 finally. So of course we're back with another Beyblade video, though. Of course, of course. But yeah, um, again we got the next couple episodes right here. We got Vault for Sling. We got um, the Jet Black Sun, Lux, Luxurus, Lux, Luxurus, um, Fire of the World, Spirit of the Fire, World Surprising, Counterattack, Luxurus. Now we try to pronounce that. But yeah, these are the next episodes for like the next Beyblade, you know, um, search series um, stuff going on. Um, for YouTube, they kind of tend to post it and stuff like that. Um, try to think of it right now. But for YouTube, they tend to post it and stuff like that. And on top of that, as well, they always kind of. I'm trying to think of it. Um, yeah, for YouTube, they tend to like to kind of keep this kind of like, you know, on the regular. Um, for like static ones like Disney XD, which I get Earth for me specifically. I have like Teletoon, like, you know, Canada does, whatever. Those are the lucky people. They look at it, got that service. But yeah. Um, again, though, we already got, like, this stuff already kind of, like, planned out, ready to go and stuff like that, of course. Um, but yeah, though, um, in the next couple episodes, they should be live already. I think they went live on May 11th. I did not record a video, like, for Beyblade, like, a really long time, so, yeah. I mean, I do every kind of other week, like, like, one week I do, one week I don't, but I try to upload the video as soon as I can. I got other stuff. Ooh, I got actually it's coming out a little bit. Um, I got other stuff I need to, um, upload and try to get out really soon, so, um, this one might come out a little bit late. Maybe Sunday or, um... Whatever chance I get to upload this video, I don't know when. Um, I'm gonna upload it over the weekend or just whatever, because I'm really gonna play Spider-Man PS4. Um, I'm gonna play that last couple of days, just relaxing and stuff like that. So yeah, until Monday, I probably got really nothing to record. The weekend usually is kind of, yeah, weekends are usually kind of like video drive, but I don't care, because again, I record at least maybe what, like every two out uh, of the whole week, maybe like two or three out the whole week or four, depending on what it gets. Not in one day, but like one other week or whatever, though. But. Whatever hits, hits the boat. So, yeah, uh, we got our next Beyblade right here, Fafnir. I believe it's called something Fafnir. I can't remember what it was. Um, I probably remember the name when I did the video and stuff like that. So, yeah, we got our next Fafnir right here. A uh, lot of two images right here. I think it's like the promotional image when it got revealed. And this one right here. Again, we like the last video, I'll post more on here. And I think in the blue video or the um, one of the other videos I did for free, I had them like already. Like, we were in Fafnir. Fafnir was coming anyway, though. Like, we did frills in the series. Then we knew Fafnir was coming anyway, and we already saw, like, saw the preview, like, the green part right here. We saw the dragon head, which is literally ripped out of, um, almost ripped out of, um, a nice whole rubber piece slash, you know, dragons are kind of just ripped right out of, um, Mirage Fafnir for the Hatterfell -Hat version. I don't know how it was for the tech right time, but it's literally ripped right out of it. I don't know, is that, like, a, is that, give me a second, is that the, okay, I think that's just, look, it's just kind of just, like, centered right there, there's nothing there. In my opinion, look at this other thing. But overall, the color scheme doesn't look that bad. I like the kind of like the red, kind of like flames right there. Um, the whole like it's just a big dragon now instead of like claws on the side. So we well, still have the claws there, but you have more of a dragon perspective. You have the red right there, which looks good though. Um, the green piece right there, the green base, of course, the back there piece of the rubber. We were seeing every step part. I think it's really super flexy this time around. Like you can flex it and stuff like that. Uh, I got the full scan right here and stuff like that. Right there, guys. So you want to see the scan right here? Let's go. Um, again, this is my promotion image right here. But yeah. We got the full scans right here, there's a lot to cover and go over. But at this point, this is completely different, nothing. Yeah, we got Free right there coming back, we got Fafnir right there, gimmicks. The same thing we saw like with, um, really Tempest Dragon though. I remember that I did that video. And I think, was it, um, Bell's New Bay? I forgot the name before already. Um, I don't know the name, is the name like Demon King? His nickname is Demon King. That's like all this. But yeah, uh, we got an export right here. Um, it seems like it makes in there. Oh, uh, we got a rubber piece, rubber piece right here. It seems like it's gonna be really flexible to turn around. It's still like the other rubber, which is just kind of basically kind of there. But we already know it's got a spin stealing word about that. The last five years, main gimmick it does go, it's gonna go left. Um, it's gonna have, of course, a different mode. Yeah, it seems like it's gonna be rubbery and stretchy, more stretchy this time around with the uh, blue outline right there. Look, it's gonna be more of a, not free spinning, but then it's gonna be, it seems like it's gonna be more flexible. Yeah, I get different though. That's a black lighting under that, because this is, um, white under right here. It's not like a base part right here, like, oh, this is a solid light. It's just like, there's nothing there. In fact, here, it seems like the part, the piece right there is kind of separate though, so yeah. Um, let me see what's right here. Um, let me see right here. Yeah, the, um, like whole you know, new kind of counter mode kind of thing right there. Of course, it's mid ceiling. So the part right there is gonna be super flexible. We got the layer, of course, the big main piece layer chip and stuff like that. Of course, um, home is looks really bulky somewhere around. Looks like nothing has gotten a little bit more of an upgrade somewhere around. Even though we seen like the big piece right there for the big like, and mid you know, stuff right there. And of course, like you know the um energy layer with the home you know not layer right there, but the bottom. But eh, whatever hits the boat. So yeah. Uh, so that's gonna be really different this time around completely though. And of course we have again the new kind of like it's gonna be more stretchery and rubbery this time around. Like, you know, um I think I have I have Fafnir somewhere. I think I have it in the middle of my head right here. Oh, I, I do, I just I grab it. Oh, 
I do have a choice, yeah. Oh, Fafnir. Yeah, I do have a Mirage Fafnir. I can put under my bed right there, so. I just going to go back over a little bit. Yeah, I got right here. Some like the rubbery piece, like right here. Like for the dragon piece, like right here, is gonna be like kind of how you got this here, right there. Don't want to zoom in too hard. Um, right there, it seems like it's gonna be like, you know, kind of like, you know, it's gonna be like, I have to have the rubbery, so of course it's gonna be different. Um, it seems like it's probably gonna be like kind of like rubbery and stretchery instead of it being like one base solid color right there. So, it seems like it's gonna be like that this time around. Let me see, move this back here. Good minutes since I have Fafnir, so yeah. I got my rush back here that has rubber and that attack goes on me. It looks like it, but it's not. He seems like that piece can be super rubbery and um, shit three this time around. Um, again, it's only get this fit with other less things. Um, yeah, the comic, the Carl Crow skin looks actually really good. It's almost like a medium skin from my Doken. If you kind of see my Doken Rider videos, so if you're new and stuff like that, of course. I uh, was it down here? Um, I saw him move over here. Nice. Yeah, the parts right there is going to be um, attached, and it's going to be sort of surgery and rubbery this time around. Of course, the chip is going to be all in one big layer. It seems like that for the left spin this time around. Looks solid though. But yeah, overall though, and of course, the art in the middle, I'm going to go back here. Um, the art in the middle seems pretty solid as well. Let's go back. Um, yeah, it seems like the art, that's just something else from like something else. But yeah, art there in the middle, of course, we got free right there to pre represent the um, character and stuff like that, of course. Um, let's do this. Um, yeah. Um, Seems like in the middle. Seems really solid though. Of course, got spin stealing just the effect right there for like the character on the bay play. Seems nice. I like it. I think it's great. I think it's awesome. Cool. Um, we got one more thing I want to kind of go over. That's pretty much it for like kind of phrase thing right there. I think right here is the same thing. Oh, there's a stadium. Now we got a new stadium right here for Grass Bro. This one is completely and utterly new. Um, yeah. Um, it's basically, you know, Hyperion's evolution, of course, on new um, Vex, um, what's his, you know, um, you know, it was for the next evolution. I forgot, forgot the name of it. Um, that's what the base calls and like that, of course. We have, um, Metroid, Spin, um, this. Of course, basically, the middle piece is gonna have, like, it's gonna act like kind of the rail system if you get, like, super mega speed off in the middle. Um, Vex looks is, and I think, um, I think it's like, what, Super Hyperion right here? Or, like, Hyper Hyperion? What is it? Um, seems like that's gonna be the summer round, but that, that, that game is, like, in the first part of the season, series, and they could take it over kind of here. The Hyperion and the Helios Stadium are pretty much both the same thing, so it doesn't really matter there. A uh, host over here, the Stadium back piece, um, yeah, they use the Beyblade name back here too. Oh, Evo, um, or like Evolved, like Flux, um, Lux is it, 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 it completely changed the name, they didn't, they didn't call it like Lucifer or whatever. Um, the Evo Flamebringer, oh, Hyperion Flamebringer, um, because we got, um, Lux is Bringer Driss, I can't remember, yeah, Bringless, um, something like that. It's like it has, it's going to be the same parts right here for Hyperion and Helios, um, I put around and say again, they're both the same. Um, seems like they're gonna be both. Um, I like the metal piece right there for the metal performance tip, and of course, like the launcher piece down there, launcher piece performance tip down there. Of course, the metal performance tip, like it gives us the gimmick the series launchers. Uh, we had a whole spinning around gimmick for the middle right there. It's kind of like um, the Diablo Stadium where I had like you know, putting batteries in the middle and stuff like that, or like the stadium from the like, I, last was the turbo. Um, we had those were basically where you basically have, you know, in the middle of stuff like that, you had like, you know, like, we had, was it, it was a night and day Beyblade, I forgot what it was called, for, well, for me, I forgot, sorry, uh, we had those in the middle, it was like battery control, we had to, um, make sure that to be one, two of them at the same time, one of those Beyblades and stuff like that, they made that into a whole stadium, and for the rails, they kind of brought that back, but it was, it was them, but you can, um, switch them up and stuff like that, I forgot the Beyblades, it wasn't like solar or something, um, not solely Eclipse, it was Silk or something I forgot already, so, um, yeah. It was kind of like that, though. So, yeah, there's a main behind back part right here. Film more stuff right here as well. The stadium pieces, of course, the whole stadium in the middle. Um, the whole stadium was like, it's really good solid color, the base, the laundry, the typical stuff right there. So this stadium actually looks really big stuff around there, so it actually looks pretty, pretty good. Oh, this is down here. Uh, we have a new launcher right here, a new shark launcher, a golden shark launcher with Colossal Helios, Hyperion. So yeah, here are Hyperion and Helios for Hasbro, it seems like they're going to be most, most of the fan favorite. The shark launcher is pretty simple and stuff like that, and more you rip it, the more progress you can see. You can go to high caliper, of course, you know, we, rip, we have to rip core, you rip it. Um, so it's going to be fully cold this time, actually, it's really nice, so yeah, again, Helios, Hyperion, just tend to get a lot of love. Yeah, it seems like it's going to be more shark themed like our Fortnite Sports. Fortnite is already shark themed. Um, we're gonna get like more of a shark kind of like golden theme right here, which I think looks really good. The shark launchers are the copy and paste shark launcher. You can go left or right. You can see your spin speed, the, more, well, the harder you rip it, the more you can get it to max. Again, this it's just like more of like kind of like a kind of casual kind of thing where you just basically spin it and stuff like that, of course. Um, where basically you can like rip it and stuff like that and spin it. You can see like your maximum like launcher speed and stuff like that. So, yeah. 
um, very simple, we're doing easy tricks, but actually give me a second, I actually need to uh, start something, um, and make sure our music is still going, it is still going, okay, so yeah, I'm um, probably pretty much going to go ahead and end the video here, I kind of want to make this really, really short, because I got some stuff I really need to do, but yeah, uh, we got a new stadium and stuff like that, we got a new, um, launchers and stuff like that, of course, um, we got a golden shark launcher, we got, um, a new colossal, what's colossal? Oh, oh, okay, no, um, Demise, okay, no, Demise Hyperion, holy crap, that looks, that looks nice. This is one of the Golden in the Dark as well, Launcher or the Beyblade Golden in the Dark. Yeah, this one's going down that, like, um, path, like, you know, when you look at Beyblade, you can kind of see the color lining coming off the spot on this tip when you look at it and stuff like that. It seems like it's going to be like that, similar round, but yeah, the Shark Launcher pretty much the same, just gold and white, and of course we got the Beyblade to represent it, Hyperion, which looks great. Again, it's like, well, only complies to the tomb and up here, Helios, Hyperion. Well, you them confused. Who cares? It doesn't matter though, so yeah. But I can go ahead and end the video here. It's really, really short though, honestly. I just want to kind of get this done because they play videos. Continue to go on really long. But yeah, we got the new stadium, we got the new um, images and stuff like that, which I will be below so you guys can see it for yourself. I'll have the main Reddit post. It's off like, we can always just, like separately and stuff like that, of course. But yeah. We got new Beyblades, of course, fact, here we got a new schedule for the next Beyblade episodes. We got a new um, stadium, um, the Doctor, Shark Launcher, which actually looks really, really good. I would love to pick up myself for Hasbro, which I probably am. Um, thank you, Brave Rock. Thank you, get the Brave Rock Jack Sparking Launcher. This could be a Sparking Launcher, actually. It might be, honestly. This is a Sparking Launcher, but, eh, hey, glow though, so, yeah, neon lights. So, yeah. Um, of course, we got Factor's images, so I would post all of them with something else, like that background, make character. Yeah, I need to be here. See you guys later, though. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great day. Great life. All good to me in, though. Make sure to stay safe. Wash your hands. Come by. All of you. If you're going to have my wear a mask, don't plug it from me, too. Let's have a good day. See you All this info. Harrison? Yeah, what do you guys think about all this info though? Of course, did you like it? Did you hate it? I like it. I think it's awesome. I think it went a little bit too fast. But I feel like I got everything pretty much. I've been here all the time, so yeah. See you guys later in the week, bro. Peace out.